flex, the flex crew over here. We're trying something different today. We're doing a little bit of vlog style videos. Uh, we're headed to Minnesota right now. We're working on a pretty cool project and we're gonna do some stroke clinics while we're there, so check it out. Fly boarding in 10 minutes. Call, uh, call the one play agent. I don't know, but I remember I just came down when you told me. They do it last minute. We love doing this. What if, what if, what if I... Okay guys, let me have... You missed this one. Thank you, sir. So we decided to get some breakfast right before our plane ride, and we get back to the gate. It's already boarded. They've already given up all of our seats, and they said we can only take three people. There's four of us. No way. No way. We made it in. Yo, Luke, wake up. Let's go do some open water. <sighs> Gotta go for a morning swim when you have views like this. So we're at this beautiful lake today and we're going to be showing you guys some drafting for open water swim. So what we're doing today is we're doing, um, what are we doing? Drafting. Yeah. So yeah, this is gonna help you guys save a lot of energy. You know, um, when you start one of these open water races, usually a lot of people in the water at the same time and then you kinda just wanna get into this rhythm behind someone, save some energy and then make the move. It's very comparable to if you're a pool swimmer and you get really close to the lane line, the person next to you when their, their draft comes up next to you, it, it pulls you a little more. It's a lot easier to, uh, swim it keeps your hips up a bit higher and you're basically just sharing the energy output in the water so the way we see it there's two different types of drafting when you're in open water race you're going to be in a massive pack of people you know you're either going to be behind somebody or next to somebody but that entire pack is going to be pushing everybody forward so the way we're going to do a normal open water workout is we're going to practice drafting for two ways one of them is going to be two people directly next to each other and each other's wakes kind of feeding off of each other the second way would be one person in the front, one person in the back. It's much easier for the person in the back to swim than the person in the front. So you would probably take turns because the water in the back is churned up. It's a lot more calm compared to what the, the person in the front is going for. <laughs> <laughs> the, last, the last like sentence is a little shaky. Yeah, it was. Yo, Luke. Yo. Let's show them what we're talking about. Let's do it. Chili? <laughs> what is it like? 50 or? It's 50 high degrees 40s, down. High 40s. In the water, I mean, the water wasn't freezing, but it's con <laughs> considering the outside temperature, 
I don't think you're right. Oh, but yeah. look at this, look what we just swam in. No guys, this is beautiful. The main point of our little drill today, you know, is just, is it more so training? If you do open waters competitively, you know what we're talking about. If you're a triathlete, you've been in this circumstance before, but drafting training is always your best policy. It's a way better way to train if you have a buddy and uh, it saves a lot of energy. Well, yeah, I think, I think one thing that's important to say too, though, is that um, we're not telling you not to go after it. You know, if you're, go if you're doing like a serious open water swim, that's not what we're telling you. We're just saying, you know, this can conserve energy throughout the race at different points, you know, and then you can go for it uh, whenever you need to. Exactly. You guys, just look at this place we're staying at right now. About to leave Minnesota, but man, we're hurting. We're all sick. We are all we all got codes from swimming in that lake in the morning. But it was worth it. And yeah. You definitely have to have a video of Luke on that swing in the video. Oh, for sure. Slow-mo. His hair like... But in a speedo. Like, totally really in a speedo. excited, like childlike enthusiasm. 